Hey everybody, you're looking live on tape from headquarters. Today I have a very different episode of Disney Uncensored. Lot to unravel here, gonna kind of walk you through the process. I bought a drone. It's something I thought about during COVID, but I never really, could never actually, I had it in the shopping cart at one point, never hit, never could hit complete. <clears throat> Drones are, the drone I wanted was about $799, pretty big investment. I found this site, I'm sure most of you that watch this have seen this site called Tamu. I've done a couple test purchases. They haven't been terrible. They haven't always been great, but I in fact did buy a drone. And today you're gonna join me. We're gonna have its inaugural flight. It could be good, it could be bad not sure probably <laughs> toward the latter but hey i'm in it all in for like 65 dollars i'm okay with that if it goes the way of the titanic lesson learned but i did receive it um timu usually takes about two to three weeks to receive the item but so far i have received i've ordered four items uh, i actually did a test which i'll show you right now so what you have before you is an actual JBL loud uh, Bluetooth speaker that I bought uh, from Amazon. And as you can see, it's a real JBL speaker. In fact, this guy is awesome. I paid about $100 for that one. And then we move on to the Timu item that was shipped to me that's supposed to be the JBL an exact copy and it I believe I paid $17 for this guy right here so as far as just obviously appearance it's not the same speaker um, in fact the sound quality on this guy like rivals like a home stereo it's ridiculously good it's I take it to the pool all the time it's waterproof synced real easy with my phone this guy sounds, I've heard better Bluetooth speakers. Like my only Bluetooth speaker I had before buying this guy was uh, this guy and my previous blue speaker, Bluetooth speaker that's probably about eight years old sounds better than this one that I bought from Timu. I think I said, again, I, it was less than 20, but far less than the hundred. But this guy absolutely rocks. I mean, it's a great speaker couldn't recommend it enough so i ordered this one uh the same date i ordered this one uh this jbl speaker came in the very next day about 5 30 in the afternoon and the tamu speaker came in about two weeks later not to be unexpected coming all the way from china this shipped directly from amazon uh dc or dis distribution center um but that kind of made me a bit nervous so the drone i originally wanted during covid uh was the dj mavic and i'll tell you a little bit about it so not to get too far into the tech talk weeds here but dj makes good stuff um they are the when i was doing a lot of gimbal work i have two models i have the 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 three and the four of the their gimbal and they do a great job and i, I enjoy it actually i prefer the three over the four i think i broke them down about a, maybe 15 to 20 episodes ago but that's neither here nor there but their drones uh run from six to nine hundred dollars depending on their latest one latest edition all that good stuff i didn't want to invest that much into it i will say this i've watched a ton of vloggers not all disney not all droney just random just everyone always seems to evolve into buying a drone and it kind of made me a little you know fomo a little man i wish i had a drone i could do so much you really can't do a whole lot especially on disney property they're banned but i felt like you know i'm not a buyer at 800 but i'm a buyer at 60. so i took the dice rolled them and uh, bought this drone from timu and uh, i'll show you a little bit about it so you do have to have the app I will say this so when you open your phone up um, I kind of went right ahead to that but it's a hit it with the QR code it's it doesn't look like this when you 
have the app on your phone. It's a more of a lateral degree. So, once you do that, you should be so in pretty that beautiful good shape. Box, you have the. I'm going to continue to call it P Hot. And if it's not right, let me know. Sorry, the Rebel Alliance needs my help. But inside the quote unquote suitcase, we'll pan out a little bit as best I can one handed. And there you have it. Now, keep in mind, I have been into this a little bit because I knew how to charge it. You had two manuals. I had a QR code to get the app, which I just showed you in the previous slide. And you had an actual instruction booklet. But here's where the actual beast lives. The P-Hot drone, the controller. If you take the controller out, I'll kind of show you the back there. That's where you slide this this portion out for batteries and there's the actual interface your phone goes here so your phone's mounted on top controls are here they do give you extra guides on the bottom there have not taken the drone itself out yet um, in the suitcase it does include the power supply the battery the legs and four extra props which scares me as they expect you to crash but we'll get it all geared up and then we'll head out Take out the app manual, scan the QR code of the corresponding mobile phone system, download and install the software. Install the battery, expand the arm of the UAV, place it on the horizontal ground, press the start button for about 3 seconds, and the light of the UAV lights up and flashes, press the remote control switch for about 2 seconds, push the left rocker up to the top, and then down to the bottom, after hearing the beep, the lights of the UAV and the remote control become normally on, the frequency matching is completed. Push the left rocker to the bottom right, the right rocker to the bottom left at the same time, the remote control beeps. The light of the UAV flashes quickly and becomes normally on. The compass calibration is completed. Open the mobile phone Wi-Fi, find the password free Wi-Fi with the name of Flow 4K, and click connect. After the connection is completed, some mobile phones will prompt that Wi-Fi has no network, ignore it, and do not disconnect or switch Wi-Fi, open the downloaded app. Click the start button, and the camera is connected successfully. All pre-flight preparations have been completed. So as you see, the instructions aren't exactly made for Americanos. However, I feel like <clears throat> I can figure it out. So now that we've got everything, we've got some decent instruction. Let's go fly this thing. Thanks for joining me. Glad you did. Let's get to it. Look over to me. So we've got it hovering. Trey. Trey's my cameraman, by the way. Um, I'm going to go up. I'm going to hover. Come down. I'm 
There's the drone. I'm gonna try to do it again. I'm gonna try to land. Okay, so I feel like I launched it. Um, it's a little bit different than the instructions told me, but I felt like it was pretty, pretty good. Um, we successfully launched and we successfully successfully landed i don't know how to oh now i'm using my brains here my <laughs> brains <laughs> all right stop that all right so i'm not sure you can see it that well but we have camera activated so when we have camera activated that means one of two things we're working and we are going so i'm gonna try to auto launch and see if we can get it going again you guys ready i want to go higher i'm gonna try to do this that's, I guess, straight up and down. So that was like our pretty good test mission. Um, I'm looking at the camera here. It's in the blades of grass with the uh, with the uh, the drone. I'm gonna get a bit more adventurous. We have full battery here. Let's see. In three, two. So, feels pretty good. Um, I'm not sure I'm recording any of the drone footage. So now my next step is to get put my face in. The <laughs> I can't see that. So now I'm gonna try to figure out how to. I'm like <laughs> keep me centered. <laughs> now I'm gonna try to figure out how to get the footage from the drone to do the footage on the phone and I think it's over here I like that noise let's see I want to try it, but I'm not sure I can. What? It's a 360 mode. But I want to build just a camera too. I'm just going to hit a button. Let's see. I can't see. 
nothing. Pretty interesting. Um, it's uh, one of those deals where it is pretty, pretty awesome. I, I would think. I mean, Trey, what are your thoughts? Mm -hmm. I couldn't see much. You couldn't see much. I should have brought my sunglasses. I want to figure out how to um, do like more recording. Oh, I've unconnected, so go ahead and stop. So the battery life is not what I expected, but still pretty good. I mean, you get a couple good shots out of there. Um, I think at this point, I'm gonna call it a success because nothing got broken.
Thanks for joining me. Glad you did. If you liked what you saw today, make sure you hit the like and subscribe. And if you hated what you saw today, blame the limited battery pack on the drone that I bought. As always, folks, keep the parks clean. So the battery life is not what I expected, but still pretty good. I mean, you get a couple good shots out of there. Um, I think at this point, I'm gonna call it a success because nothing got broken. Thanks for joining me, glad you did. If you liked what you saw today, make sure you hit the like and subscribe. And if you hated what you saw today, blame the limited battery pack on the drone that I bought. As always folks, keep the parks clean.